Wednesday at Falcons training camp was really the first time we've gotten to see tight end Kyle Pitts since he tore his MCL last November. Pitts says he feels pretty close to 100% and he was participating in passing drills, running, even making some cuts, although he did sport a brace on that right knee as a precaution. As you can imagine, it turns out that actually being able to actively participate in practice and be around his teammates is a lot more fun than having to be the behind the scenes guy and other off season activities. So Pitts is so glad to be back in action. Very anxious, you know, just say, you know, being on the inside and OTAs and watching, you know, it's obviously, it's just like, it just make you grind a little harder, you know, when you want to get back out there. Felt, felt pretty good. Yeah. It's it fun being, being back out here with the guys and, you know, the fellowship was always good being out, being out here, having fun playing ball. Yeah. Well, it was definitely hard, but it was just time for me to get stronger and, you know, be ready for this season. When asked if he still had any limitations put on him by coaches or training staff at practice, Pitts deferred to Falcons coach Arthur Smith. And Smith did make it seem like Pitts is still kind of slowly ramping up his activity, which makes sense. It's basically his first day back. I mean, you're not going to ask him to do 100 plays a day, but uh, with a lot of our guys. I mean, it, you know, these ramp up periods, we're only out there for 90 minutes. And there's only so many reps. I mean, we'll do a lot more individual. We'll obviously have some 7-on-7 seven -seven team, and we'll just kind of build off that every day. The fact that he's out there practicing is going to take some, some reps, and we'll be smart, but that's a very encouraging sign. This Falcons team went 7-10 and 10 last season, and Pitts was only able to participate in 10 of those games. If there was one thing that was motivating him in his rehab, besides simply getting back healthy and being able to play again, it was wanting to be a part of establishing a winning culture here in Atlanta. Just, you know, getting back to like just a winning culture, um, you know, this team, myself, just everybody wants to win. So just, you know, grinding so that we can all come back together and do that. I mean, I think, you know, if we do our job and all come together as one, things will work.